I'm David Wilkerson, Offensive Coordinator at Northeast Mississippi Community College. Uh, today we're going to deal with uh, beating a blitz. And uh, in today's society with the spread offense, uh, the blitz, handling the blitz is why it's so important. Uh, there's some different ways that we're going to talk about handling the blitz. And uh, uh, we're going to go over a couple of them today in this video. We've been real successful in some of the things that we've done. And also, we're going to cover them and show, explain them to you and explain them to you and show them to you where they're easy to understand where hopefully you, you can get something and uh, it will be successful for you and your program. We want to uh, we want to go over ways to deal with controlling the blitz and uh, we're going to cover five different ways today about control with beating and controlling the blitz. The first way that we want to talk about is screens. Uh, uh, we, we feel that screens are real important of our offense, a real important part of our offense. And uh, I have a reputation in our league of throwing screens on any down. Uh, uh, we run screen back screens, we run inside receiver screens, we run tunnel screens, we run outside outside receiver screens, and uh, but with and also bubble screens. So we have screens to every all five uh, uh, of our receivers, and and. The rep reputation that I have uh, precedes what we're uh, trying to talk about because uh, uh, we run them on every down. Any down dictates uh, uh, screen uh, screen pass. First, second, second, or third down, down a distance does not matter. The number two type that we want to talk about today is uh, moving the pocket. Uh, sprint protection, moving the pocket either left or right with our slide protection. Number three, uh, max protect. Uh, which is seven-man protection. Uh, defense usually brings five or six. Uh, if you have seven-man protection and you set your protection screen, uh, protection, then you can uh, then you can handle a blitz. Uh, the fourth uh, fourth type is a uh, option. If you run, uh, we run two types of option: speed option and zone option. And uh, depending on what the defense does, is depends on what type we run. Uh, but if you get inside blitz, the option's a, gr uh, a great counter for that. Then the, the uh, fifth type is freezing, which is uh, holding the snap count, letting the defense dictate or show you where the, the blitz is coming from. And then we try to call a play to uh, usually a screen uh, where, the, where that blitz is, where they're showing us where the blitz is coming from back at that, at, at that blitz. T today, we're, we're going to cover two of the five types. In the other videos, then we will we will cover the other three uh, parts of uh, ways to beat the blitz. Today, I want to talk about uh, a way to beat the blitz is moving the pocket, which is our 80 game or our sprint game. Uh, if you get inside blitz from Mike, or if you get Will off the edge, what we want to do is try to move our pocket and try to get our quarterback outside. Then we tag routes with our receivers. Uh, our, our protection, our protection on our sprint game, uh, we make a, a left or right call, and then all he does, the, the play side guard uh, block stays square and blocks the gap to his right. The outside, ta the tackle blocks outside, he stays high on the end, and they try to stay square. The center's got a gap to the play, and then the backside guard has got the a gap, then the backside tackle.